Will. So, what's it like living and working in China? Edgar. Well, to be honest, in today's globalized world, there isn't really all that much difference anymore, especially in big cities like Shanghai, where I'm based. There's a lot of traffic, crowded subways and buses, tall skyscrapers and modern shopping malls, just like in other large cities around the world. Will. So, what's it like living and working in China? Edgar. Well, to be honest, in today's globalized world, there isn't really all that much difference anymore, especially in big cities like Shanghai, where I'm based. There's a lot of traffic, crowded subways and buses, tall skyscrapers and modern shopping malls, just like in other large cities around the world. Will. So, what's it like living and working in China? Edgar. Well, to be honest, in today's globalized world, there isn't really all that much difference anymore, especially in big cities like Shanghai, where I'm based. There's a lot of traffic, crowded subways and buses, tall skyscrapers and modern shopping malls, just like in other large cities around the world. Will. Have any differences struck you? Edgar. Well, the food is very different, and eating with chopsticks was tricky at first, especially rice and noodles. But I got the hang of it. Will. Have any differences struck you? Edgar. Well, the food is very different, and eating with chopsticks was tricky at first, especially rice and noodles. But I got the hang of it. Will. Have any differences struck you? Edgar. Well, the food is very different, and eating with chopsticks was tricky at first, especially rice and noodles. But I got the hang of it. Will. Have any differences struck you? Edgar. Well, the food is very different, and eating with chopsticks was tricky at first, especially rice and noodles. But I got the hang of it. Will. What about the language? Edgar. Most of the people I work with speak English well. I'm still learning Chinese to handle everyday situations. Will. What about the language? Edgar. Most of the people I work with speak English well. I'm still learning Chinese to handle everyday situations. Will. What about the language? Edgar. Most of the people I work with speak English well. I'm still learning Chinese to handle everyday situations. Will. Is there anything else you're not used to yet? Edgar. No. I've adjusted to the way of life. However, there's still one thing that's kind of weird to me. In China, the family name comes before the first name, and millions of people have the same surname. For example, Wang, Li, Zhang, Chen, and so on are the most common. Will. Is there anything else you're not used to yet? Edgar. No. I've adjusted to the way of life. However, there's still one thing that's kind of weird to me. In China, the family name comes before the first name, and millions of people have the same surname. For example, Wang, Li, Zhang, Chen, and so on are the most common. Will. Is there anything else you're not used to yet? Edgar. No. I've adjusted to the way of life. However, there's still one thing that's kind of weird to me. In China, the family name comes before the first name, and millions of people have the same surname. For example, Wang, Li, Zhang, Chen, and so on are the most common. Will. Will. No kidding. Edgar. Yeah, at work when I called out Joe, three colleagues used to answer me. But I managed to solve the problem. Will, what did you do? Will, no kidding. Edgar, yeah, at work when I called out Joe, three colleagues used to answer me. But I managed to solve the problem. Will, what did you do? Your ending. What do you think Edgar answers? I found out the first name of each one. Together we came up with a Western name for each. John, George, and Joe. I left my workstation and went and talked to each one. Your idea. Your ending. What do you think Edgar answers? I found out the first name of each one. Together we came up with a Western name for each. John, George, and Joe. I left my workstation and went and talked to each one. Your idea. Your ending. What do you think Edgar answers? I found out the first name of each one. Together we came up with a Western name for each. 
John, George, and Joe. I left my workstation and went and talked to each one. Your idea. Real talk. To be honest, used to state something more directly, to get the hang of, to get used to doing something the right way, kind of, rather. No kidding. An expression of surprise and disbelief. Real talk. To be honest, used to state something more directly, to get the hang of, to get used to doing something the right way, kind of, rather. No kidding. An expression of surprise and disbelief. Real talk. To be honest, used to state something more directly, to get the hang of, to get used to doing something the right way, kind of, rather. No kidding. An expression of surprise and disbelief. About the conversation. 1. What things does Edgar say are the same in Shanghai? 2. What's his conversational Chinese like? 3. What did Edgar find difficult at first? 4. What is unusual about Chinese surnames? About the conversation. 1. What things does Edgar say are the same in Shanghai? 2. What's his conversational Chinese like? 3. What did Edgar find difficult at first? 4. What is unusual about Chinese surnames? About the conversation. 1. What things does Edgar say are the same in Shanghai? 2. What's his conversational Chinese like? 3. What did Edgar find difficult at first? 4. What is unusual about Chinese surnames? Answers. Answers will vary. Sample answers. 1. There's a lot of traffic, crowded buses, tall buildings, and modern shopping malls. 2. He's still learning Chinese for everyday situations. 3. Eating with chopsticks was difficult for him at first. 4. The surnames come before the first names and millions of people have the same surname. Answers. Answers will vary. Sample answers. 1. There's a lot of traffic, crowded buses, tall buildings, and modern shopping malls. 2. He's still learning Chinese for everyday situations. 3. Eating with chopsticks was difficult for him at first. 4. The surnames come before the first names and millions of people have the same surname. Answers. Answers will vary. Sample answers. 1. There's a lot of traffic, crowded buses, tall buildings, and modern shopping malls. 2. He's still learning Chinese for everyday situations. 3. Eating with chopsticks was difficult for him at first. 4. The surnames come before the first names and millions of people have the same surname. Your turn. Role play the conversation like the one above but using a different country. Express surprise at some of the things mentioned. Your turn. Role play the conversation like the one above but using a different country. Express surprise at some of the things mentioned. Your turn. Role play the conversation like the one above but using a different country. Express surprise at some of the things mentioned.